Yo, what is going on folks? You're here chilling with the real Satoshi Aoki. In today's video, I've got an awesome gameplay and introduction style video for you today about Soul Chicks. It's going to be an NFT blockchain gaming RPG project built on Solana blockchain. I'm very excited and was very happy when I had a dev reach out to me about this particular project. So I agreed to actually make some content for them. It's going to be a really exciting video today, guys. I'm going to show you the basic concepts and intro of what Soul Chicks is. Full disclosure, folks, I will be investing in the Chick token in the upcoming IDO, and I have already purchased a Soul Chick NFT off the actual Solana uh, marketplace. So I'm going to show you both those things as well as some nice gameplay. Folks, if you like blockchain gaming, you like NFTs, you've come to the right place. Place. I cover all of the best blockchain gaming and NFT content on the Satoshi Aoki YouTube channel and I will always tell you whether I'm invested or not and what the pros and cons are about the project. So if you're into all of that, drop a like on the video, smash that button because it does help me out on the channel, subscribe and turn the notification bells on. And if you've got any questions or comments about Soul Chicks, let me know. And just let me know what you thought about this video, this gameplay video about Soul Chicks. Guys, they got a lot going on in this company. I'm very excited to bring you this video. So let's check it out right now. Alrighty folks, so we are at SolanaArt.io. This is actually the Soul Chick NFTs right here. Folks, just barely even two weeks ago, these little beauties were under five Solana. Unfortunately, I didn't actually pick anything up at that time, but I did just get in at around 10 Solana today, and I did actually pick one up. So these are the actual in-game NFTs that you will be using in-game. Okay, they've got some really cute little traits and all sorts of things going on. What can I say, guys? Soul Chicks, you know, they're cute funny, cuddly, and they're gonna have some serious in-game utility from what I can see. They are one of the top trending projects, guys. If we actually have a look here, okay, Soul Chicks at the moment are trending at 6.5K Solana, okay? So they're right up there, really establishing themselves in this early stage as a potential blue chip favorite for the Solana blockchain and maybe even NFTs on the whole in this space that we are so early on in. And one thing I actually wanna say as well, guys, is that I am a gamer, okay? I do play a lot of video games, all right and you know i'm really looking for games that are actually going to be fun as well as games that you can actually play to earn okay i'm all about pushing this play to earn movement through my youtube channel and community and if we just have a look here guys this is crypto slam you can actually see there's a lot of transactions that are going through now so a lot of flourishing movement on the soul chicks marketplace here as we can see guys some big sales guys look eight soul 1701 here okay but keep scrolling down keep scrolling down 13 soul 2774 dollars Guys, for Soul Chicks 1761 with the laser eyes. Guys, it's a flourishing marketplace. Venture capitalists and people in the NFT space are seeing the potential value in Soul Chicks. So let's actually head over, guys. And I do actually want to let you know as well that all of the necessary links will be in the description of this video. And let me know if you want to see more videos about Soul Chicks in the future at the end of this video. So this is soulchicks.io. We're not going to go into a deep dive of the website. We're going to do that in another video. But one thing I do want to draw your attention to is the fact that the Chicks, C-H-I-C-K-S, IDO guys at 2 p.m. UTC on the 26th of November 2021, which is just five days away. Okay, we'll be just under five days away when this video is published tonight. Okay, so again, I did tell you guys I am going in on this IDO. Okay, I'm going in on this IDO. I'm going to get amongst set, guys. If you want to get involved, guys, the whitelist information and pre-registration is here again link in the description guys it's got a 200k plus members guys in their communities very very bullish all the links for their discord twitter and telegram here and while we are here actually guys i actually just want to click on the twitter very very quickly just to show you okay what kind of following these guys have guys because this is serious this is an elite level following for the crypto space 99.2k followers they've only been on twitter here from september in 2021 okay so make sure you're following them and turn the notification bells on okay so if we actually just go back here guys I'm gonna scroll down and there is just one little video I just do want to show you and then don't worry we're going to get cracking into some actual demo gameplay it's a bit of a teaser if you like of what they have involved so let's just play this video guys it's a minute and nine seconds and yeah tell me what you
Alrighty, folks, so that basically gave you, I guess, a comprehensive view and some context about what Soul Chicks is trying to do, okay? So they do have a lot going on. They are very, very early st stage, but they're one of the few projects that have attracted a lot of attention. And seriously, this is just the definition of snowball effect, guys. You know how strong and powerful social media is, and they do have a lot of backing. And on top of that, guys, you know, aside from the reasons why I'm invested in this project, which I've just shown you guys, I think it's really, really cool. We're going to scroll down, okay? And we're actually just going to have a bit of a look. Even just look here, guys. Have a look at the high quality of this gameplay, okay? So they've got some solid development going on. It is built on Unity, okay? Now, if we do keep scrolling down, folks, again, this is not a deep dive into the actual website in today's video, but I just want to show you guys credentialed team with experience from leading blue chip organizations. And you can actually see all 50 plus team members here. This is what I like to see, folks. Fully transparent team with their LinkedIn's descriptions. Profile pictures, okay? None of this nonsense, you know, using their NFTs as profile pics, okay? That's definitely very hypocritical since I do that. But guys, I'm not trying to pitch to you a project for investment because if I was, my face would be on it for sure. And I just think it really does say, say a lot, okay? When they, you know, they're showing who they are here, okay? I think it's a pretty big deal. Okay, let's stop faff and actually let's get into it. So if you actually want to play the uh, demo access, guys, I highly recommend you come over and give it a go. You just have to complete a few really simple tasks. It takes just a couple of minutes, you know, you got to uh, retweet on your Twitter as well as do a couple of little simple things. I've actually already done that, okay? So if you actually see here what's gonna happen, I'm gonna click login with Twitter. Okay, it's gonna redirect me back because I've actually already done this process. And as you can see here, folks, all you gotta do, guys, is follow at SoulChicksNFT on Twitter, retweet at SoulChicksNFT on Twitter, and then you can just gain access, guys. It's as simple as that. And I think, guys, that's pretty fair enough, okay? I think that's smart. It's a good level of marketing, and it's a really good way to actually get the actual project out there, okay? There's no harm in just, you know, following and retweeting, okay? It's all good, okay? And let's go ahead and actually jump in, guys, and play the demo. Alrighty, folks, so we're gonna jump into some Soul Chicks gameplay at the moment, okay? There was a little intro video that I I just fast forwarded through that's going to be available on the actual soul chicks website on the front okay but we want to get straight into some gameplay as you can say we see we've got a uh, character selection here okay so really really cute here guys we've got the bishop we've got the gladiator and the wizard okay so the wizard and the bishop are coming soon all right so we're going to choose the gladiator as you can see resolve gladiators do not use mana and are unable to cast spells but instead will have a small energy pool to use their abilities titanic strength gladiators are able to use heavy weapons and armor. Sounds exciting. So let's get into it, guys. So you've got stats, equipment, and items, okay? So I'm not going to go into all the details of reading these out. There's quite a bit going on here, okay? Stats, skills, you've got secondary stats, stats here, primary stats as well, you've got HP, that's your mana pool here, your class there, okay? You've got some items as well. You might even be able to purchase some extra NFTs, and you've got your equipment here as well. So let's just get straight on into this, guys. So as you can see, the game controls are here. You've got your item slots here. Okay, movement's going to be with the mouse. It's going to be a click and point, guys. All right, we've got move, attack. Great, let's go, let's go. Let's go. Let's have a go at this. All righty, so let's have a bit of a go, guys. So what's going on? An uneasy welcome. The air is thick with a sense of ominous foreboding. Town folks speak in hushed whispers and eye strangers. Okay, let's have a look. An uneasy welcome. The first objective is to speak to Elder Chikrik. Okay, Elder Chikrik. So guys, just straight off the bat, you can zoom in. Zoom out, okay? It feels good, okay? So I'm assuming like when you go in, you're gonna be able to play as your NFT. There's gonna be benefits to having that, okay? And let's have a look. Ah, oh, adventurer, you have come at an opportune time. Someone has been spreading rumors that a soul fox will attack our village and we believe that it may be an attempt by our enemies to undermine us. Please find who is responsible for the malicious and unfounded rumors, understand their motives. Go forth to the town center and report back with any information. Okay, that sounds exciting. Yes, uh, enter, or do we click away? Okay, ah oh, yeah, so we accept, yes, 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 okay. So we're gonna accept that quest, sounds good, and go to the town square and speak to the worried villager. Okay, so we've gotta go to the town square. I don't know if there's a map, I think I did see a map on the early gameplay, um, but I'm just gonna walk around, folks, and just have a look. So what is this? Is this to, is this to go to the village? So we've entered here, ah, oh, okay, so we're at a bar now. Okay, so we're going to a par. This is cute. So you can actually talk to them as well, guys. Drink. The world is ending anyways. Okay, cool, cool. Drunk patron. Okay. And go up. So I don't think this is the town center, but... Oh, yeah, this guy looks all right. Bugger off. All right, mate, I will. That was a bit rude, wasn't it? Um, okay, let's go out. So I'm a, this is just a bar, guys. So we're going to leave this place. Not very welcome here. So that was a bar. 
So, wait. Oh, hang on. Wait, but this is... Is that the village? Oh, no. Okay. I'm not actually sure. Go to the town square. Okay. Town square. Who's this? Maybe this guy. What's the matter? Okay. Ah, oh, yeah. This is the worried villager, guys. Do you not know? Janata has gone silent in recent weeks, and Thug Mike at the bar has been telling everyone that he has seen the Soul Fox. We're all going to die! Seems that Thug Mike may know something about this. Better have a talk with him at the bar. Alright, and let's accept the quest. Cool, guys. So, it's a nice little basic RPG. And I've got to say, folks, for a demo, this is cool. I'm engaged. And this is what I'm talking about, guys. You know, play to earn is a great concept, but if you're not having fun while playing to earn, then it kind of just is like a job. You know, I might as well just have a normal job, you know. I'm all about finding the games that are fun and I can be play to earn. Okay, and I play to earn, you know, then we've really made it. So this is, I think this is the guy up here, the rude guy. So be it. Okay, it seems thus Mike is not willing to cooperate. If so, we have to make him. Defeat Thug Mike. Okay, so we've got to start some shit now, guys. Accept. Stop, stop, yield. All right, are we beasting this guy then? How do we, all right, stop, stop, yield. Take this, I'm only under the orders from Janata. She paid me. The scandal! As Mike handed me the crumpled note, I cannot help but notice that while Doomsday incantation scribbled madly across the parchment, at the edges of the wrinkled note is signed in blood, Janada. Okay. Elder Chikrik must know who Janada is. I must head back at once to inform him. Okay. It turns out Mike is the village coward and yielded as soon as I drew my blade, but as Mike handed me the crumpled note, I cannot help but notice the wild Doomsday thing. Oh yeah, we've already read that. Sorry guys. All right, return to Elder Chikrit. Okay, so we've done, you know, we've done the research, guys. We've been moving around. Now we're going back to the Elder. Okay. Let's go back out. Okay, cool. We're back at the village and Elder Chikrit. This is him, the wizard. Janata, how could she? Hero Janata is our town oracle and elder mage tasked to protect our village against the corrupt and the fell. There must be something more to this. Head to her abode at the northeast end of the village. Make haste. Okay, let's do this then. North east, so I guess it's gonna be this way. Find Janata, the oracle at village's north east end. Okay, here she is. Cool. Fools, I knew I couldn't trust those simpletons to do our work. You think you've found me, but it's too late now. Time to face the wrath of righteous fire. This sounds scary. Let's accept it. Oh, so she disappeared. Turned to Elder Chikrik. So it looks like uh, old mate Janata is possibly up to a bit of no good. Is she a soul fox? All right, let's have a look. Thank you, hero. This is indeed dire news. The cult of the soul fox has to be stopped. We will inform the Grand Imperial Council at once. Okay. It seemed that Janata had been allowed to fulfill her devious plan while you were out investigating. The rumours our scouts have reported sightings of a Soul Fox at the Kutkar Boneyard to the north. If the Soul Fox strikes, we will not be able to hold him off. To think this is the end. Sigh. Regardless, we cannot go down without a fight. I ask of you, brave adventurer, will you be our champion? I will gather the braves and meet you at the Boneyard. Well, I guess I don't really have a choice, so let's do it. <laughs> Go north and head to the Kutkar Boneyard and defeat the Soul Fox, okay? So, that's what it's about. I'm a soul champion chick, so let's do this. So, we're heading north. Graphics look good, guys. Gameplay is, is smooth. I can't complain, guys. Again, drop a like if you like this content, guys. Are you sure you're about to enter battle with the Soul Fox? Okay, let's do this. All right, guys, we are going... Think to meet the Soul Fox. Kutkar Boneyard. Okay, so Soul Fox has got 6,000 hit points. Defeat the Soul Fox. Alright, let's do this. We've got some friends. Are these guys trying to help us? Okay, so I'm guessing this is like the first fight or boss fight or whatever. Oh god. Okay, right click. What's happening? Critical. Wait. Oh, actually, wait. I think I need to use abilities. Oh my goodness, guys. I don't even know what buttons to press. Wait. Oh, oh yes, no, wait, wait, am I hitting him? Uh, oh, sorry guys, I messed up, okay, wait. Hold on, hold on. Ah, here we go, here we go, here we go, so I'm casting spells now, okay, okay. I'm gonna go for this E spell, 
not exactly sure. That he, okay, so this is doing some damage, I think. I cannot cast that yet. What's R? What's R do? Alright, this is like some kind of shield. Uh, two. That's like some hit points. Okay, so this is cool. So, we are fighting with the Elder Chick Creek. But where is... Where's the Brave Villager? What's what's going on with the Brave Villager right now? I really don't know. I've already used that. Uh, okay, so we've got... Oh, no, wait. Okay. Got to use those arrows so I get cool down there. I'm not exactly sure which ones do damage, but I think maybe my main spell is Q. Let's go. Come on, come on. Nice, nice. Okay, cool, 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 cool. Don't want to get hit too much. Um, what's this? What's this do? Okay, so that's like a revive. Okay, so I'm getting HP back by using that third spell, so that's cool. Ah, no. Wait. This is fun, guys. <laughs> What's E again? Wait. Yeah! Take that! Nice! Okay. I'm out of, like, spells, but let's... Guys, I'm not being funny, like, this is actually fun, guys. I think doing this, like, with some friends it would just be super cool. Like, I'm not even joking. This is definitely something I'm going to be following up. Oh, no! I died! Okay, I guess we're going to retry. Nice guys, nice. So, got spells. I haven't really worked out exactly how to use my Q ability yet. It's a bit, it's a bit weird, but this W weakens him. Yeah, and this is like a... I don't know if that's like a shield or something. So I think that... I think the Q... The Q, when I hit Q, it, some, it goes out to my allies. I don't know if it like strengthens them up or not. I'm not exactly sure. This definitely weakens him, and then... Ah, uh, it makes my, makes my friends faster. Okay, okay. Alright guys, so this is an intense battle. He's really coming for me. Why does he keep coming for me all the time? Like, what's up? Like, what did I do, man? Made them faster. Let's weaken him a bit. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Nice, nice, let's go. Okay, okay. Alright, we don't want to drop the E-bomb on this guy, guys. Wait. Hit you with that, and then I'll hit you with E. Oh, I need mana. I need mana, I think. Bit of shield. Gotta get that shield going. Nice. Hey, or was that, or was that me? <laughs> a little low on health. Okay, I'll take a bit more HP or I'll recover. God, he's really hunting me down right now. Okay, let's E this guy. Take that. Okay, so E is like one of my better abilities, I would say. Q seems to help my friends. The W seems to like maybe lower his shield or make him a bit weaker, but not take his HP. E is like some good sort of AoE damage. And R is like a, like a shield of some kind. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. So I think what I'm going to do is hit the R, if I have enough mana, and then hit the E. Oh dear. Okay, I need to be careful. Need to heal up. I need like full mana right now. Alright, R, and then... Oh no! Oh, I messed that up, man. Oh my goodness, we still got... He's still not even halfway down. This is not, not that easy. Ah, oh, alright, did a bit of damage there. Is there any items around here, maybe? Oh, crud. Alright, let's go for, uh... Ah! Uh, e! Come on, come on, come on, come on! Take it, take it! Okay, I'm doing okay, I'm doing okay. 
Oh dear. Oh no, no, no. That's not good. That's not good. Okay, he's weak. Ah, oh, come on, come on. Ah. Okay, so I think I've worked out the combinations, guys. Maybe. So I've got to go a W and then an E. R, W, E, perhaps. Uh, or maybe even just W, E. Let's go, let's go. W and then E. Okay, okay, okay. He's down. Oh, I think I've worked it out, guys. But, unfortunately, health is, like, really low now. God damn. Ah, no. Oh my goodness, he's so low, 1,000. Couldn't possibly die here. Ah, oh, God, come on, come on. i got to get my mana back up. Ah, oh, no. No, come on, damage him, damage him. Go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's go. Ah, he's 774, it's so close. Oh, I'm screwed. I'm screwed. Wait, what the heck is that? Wait. Oh, he's on 756, guys. What on earth? Ah. One. This is the one. This is the one. Nice. Good, good, good. Okay, did a bit of damage there. Alright, guys, so I'm kind of going in using W first. Kind of weaken him a bit. And then E is area of effect. Q, like, helps my other two friends. And R is like a parry ability. So if we watch W, E, and parry. Don't know if I'm using the parry correctly. And I'll help my friends out as well to get a few extra blows in. I might actually weaken him first, then use the Q, and then use the E for area of effect. But I need to get to 10 mana so I can kind of hit them all in consecutive order, okay? I'm going to take them down this round. Alright, so W, Q, E. Ah. I lost a fair bit of health there, but I'm gonna hold on. Fox, he's on 125 health. I'm about to die. I'm so close to death. I'm gonna need my my helpers to really help me out here. 97 HP. Oh, I'm gonna be shattered if I don't get this. I'm gonna be literally shattered if we don't do this. I've got no health left. Ah! Come on! No! No, 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 get away, get away. 54 HP, one hit, and I'm dead, I reckon. Oh my goodness. Three health, yes! Victory, and we've done it. Oh my god, that was hard. We celebrated like we've never before. As if we knew we wouldn't be celebrating for a long time, long time. Somehow, deep down. All of us knew. All of us knew. It was a period of victory, victory, which we never which recovered, we never from. recovered from. from. The soul fox came, came back, more vicious, more vicious and more powerful, more powerful than we were spent. We, were spent. We, fought we fought valiantly, but alas, but in, alas vain, in vain, we had no choice had but no to choice abandon, to our, abandon planet. our planet. The young say the something young say and all something of us and died that day. Died that along with the demise, with the demise of our demise home, of Chico. Our home Chico. They say that they we cling onto old, old scars and they could see it, in our, see eyes. it in our eyes. But we've never been, we've more, never determined. been more determined. We need to get, even, need stronger to get even stronger and protect, and protect our, our, home, our home, our loved ones. Our loved ones. For we are soldiers, we are soldiers. and this and is our story. story. Join, the Join the soldiers' revolution today. today. 
Alrighty folks, that's all for today's gameplay and intro video about Soul Chicks. If you liked the video, drop a like on this video, subscribe to the channel, and turn the notification bells on. And look forward to seeing you in the next video. Cheers.